Welcome to Twisted Brush Pro Studio. I'm using version 17.21. In this video, I'm going to uh, cover the record time lapse painting. Uh, previously, this feature was called Record to AVI. It uh, resided in the same menu in the same location here. Now it's called Record Time Lapse Painting. Um, recording a time lapse painting, um, as you might guess by, by the name, is will uh, record to a video uh, while you're painting uh, snapshots of your work at uh, a predefined time frame. Um, before you get started, well, we'll put up the pull up the menu first. Record time lapse um, painting. This is a dialog which can stay open. Um, before we hit record, one thing that you'll want to do that's required for uh, recording uh, time lapse painting is make sure your your page size is uh, appropriate for for video recording. Uh, one of the easiest ways to do this is go to the page menu and select set page size. Uh, click on the video uh, option here and uh, here in this case one very common size if you want to upload to YouTube would be uh, the selection here which is uh, for HD, this is the size recommended uh, by YouTube if you're going to upload there. Uh, so you select that, say OK. If your my page is already set to that size, but if your page wasn't, it would be resized to that. So to start recording, uh, the next step is you'll want to set the number of frames you want to capture per minute. Um, so depending upon how long and and complicated your painting is and how long your resulting video you want your resulting video to be you'll you'll set this and with a slider you can determine how many frames per minute you want to capture from from one frame per minute which means for an hour of painting you'll have six seconds of video so it's very uh, uh, the time lapse will be very slow uh, or you can go all the way up where it's uh, one hour of painting would be one hour of video and uh, Generally, you'd want to do something in between there, depending upon how long uh, and complicated your video or your painting is uh, going to be. So in this case, I'm just going to do one hour of painting equals 20 minutes video. I'm just going to record a very short video for, for demonstration purposes. And I can set select uh, record. Uh, the next step will be to select the file name. I'm just going to... Um, bump up this file name here, say save. After you select the file name and sec select save, the video compression dialog will come up. Uh, I highly recommend using an MPEG-4 uh, codec, um, and that's available in a number of different uh, packages. Um, the one I primarily use is one called FF D show video codec. You c that's a free package that you can download from a number of different locations. I'll pull up uh, the websites. You can download it, for example, from mediacodec.org. Uh, it includes uh, the FFD show package. You it's also included in Klight codec pack, um, and also FFD show tryouts. Download those. It's free one of those, download it, it's free, install it, and it will then restart Twisted Brush and the option will be available for you here. Once you've selected the FFD show video codec, select configure. I don't let the the number of options here overwhelm you. Really all you have to do is select the first option, MPEG-4, and select OK. You don't have to change any of those settings if you don't want to. I I never do. Last step here is just say OK. And now you're recording. And you can see, select the brush. As we're recording, we're keeping account of the number of frames and how many seconds of video that have been recorded. Notice that when I'm not painting or I'm not updating my canvas, the co recording automatically pauses for you. Now I'm going to continue this uh, video in uh, part two. So be sure to check that out.